Most of the croissants you see in the world are just made with white flour. They're more predictable and what everybody's expected. White flour is always soft and, and predictable, easy to use. Whole grain croissants, like whole grain bread, come with their own challenges. Um, namely, the flour performs differently. It's denser. Uh, and so, so you have to be a little bit more, t you can't just take any recipe and apply it to whole grain. You've got to adjust it to whole grain. And so it comes with a little bit of an understanding of baking, but the, the benefits of working with whole grain really are, are almost endless. And I could, I could give days and days of information on this, but essentially a, a white flour, it's not that white flour is, is inherently evil by any means, but it's sort of stripped of a lot of the things that we valued in, in wheat in the first place. So wheat has been a human staple uh, for a long time. You could argue uh, successfully that, that wheat was one of the reasons why we've multiplied across the world well and, and have such a dominant human population. Because um, it's, it's just this abundant grass that grows all over the place and in, in many climates and this grass turns into this nutrient dense food that can literally sustain you. I mean, military rations are, are bread based rations. Like there's a reason that, uh, that bread is, is what it is, is it, it kept us alive. But the bread that keeps us alive is the bread that's packed with all parts of the wheat berry, meaning the bran, the germ, and the endosperm. White flour is just made of the endosperm, and it's really just like a starchy carbohydrate. Uh, it doesn't have a whole lot of uh, balance nutritionally, and so white bread is really the main reason why you have all the people that are around the world right now that, that are saying, don't eat too much bread. Uh, Historically, 80% of our calories have come from grains, but it's the proteins and the fats combined with the carbohydrates that are present in whole grain breads that, that make them beneficial for us. Uh, and that's just simply not the case with white bread.